before we will jump right into the tutorial, I want to make a short introduction. If you need any help of me and my team, then please don't hesitate to contact us. We will help you with any technical problems with your website. Below this video, you will find our contact details. See you soon. Bye. Hi there, Mike Giannotti here, and I had a friend of mine ping me today. She was looking to embed videos in her WordPress posts, and she wanted to automatically have it detect and generate a thumbnail that could be used so that when she posted her post out to Facebook, it would pick up the image and display that. So I'm going to quickly show you how we can do that. So I actually have a website here we're going to open up. It's a very simple process. So here is my michaelanthonygenati.com site, not my usual Michael Gennati tech site that you're on right now. And on this site, it's kind of my, oh, I don't know, my resume site as it were. But I'm going to go ahead and we're going to drop down to something called plugins. And this is where we need to add the appropriate plugin to automatically detect our YouTube video when we publish and to then generate the needed thumbnails. So we're going to go ahead and select add new and we're going to type in here something that I use on all my other ones video thumbnails and we're going to click search that easy here we have a result set and at the very top notice how it says video thumbnails and it says video thumbnails makes it easy to automatically display video thumbnails in your template when you publish a post this plugin will find the first video embedded and retrieve a thumbnail for you. Thumbnails can be saved to your media library and set as the featured image automatically. So what we need to do here is underneath the word, we're going to select install now. It asks, are we sure? Yeah, I'm sure. So I'm going to click OK. There we go. It's now going to go ahead. It's successfully installed it. The next step is to activate. So see here where it says activate, we're going to click that. And now we have video thumbnails activated. So now if I come out here to post and I select add new, you'll notice here on the right hand side, there it is video thumbnail. So when it's found, when they find one, it's going to go ahead, it's going to populate this with a thumbnail and create a featured image. Now, just so you know, depending on your template, it may show that featured image here in the body of the uh, post or not. This particular one it will, so it's going to have a big image stuck in here right above the video, but for our purposes that's okay. So let's go ahead and let's say this is my video demo. There's my title. I'm so original. I amaze myself. And we're going to say, uh, we're going to actually, we need a video to add. So we're going to pick one from a, a, an event I was involved with this went this uh, last weekend and I'm going to say this is Greg and Lizzie singing they rock the house exclamation marks all right there we go so I've got some introductory text I'm going to hit enter and now I'm going to go out to YouTube where I have videos and oh looky right there I've gone to this video with Greg and Lizzie at the Abbey Fest. I'm going to copy that particular piece of text that is the embed uh, code. Come back here to my new post. I'm going to click on text and next to that space where we made it, we'll go ahead and paste that. Click visual. There we go. There's my post that we're going to have. The key is watch this. Now that we have this new plugin, when I select publish, it's going to go ahead, go do its stuff. Boom. And look at what it's done. Let's scroll down. It created a video thumbnail and a featured image. That's what's going to get picked up by Facebook. So if we go ahead, let's browse to the top and select view post. And so there's that image. It inserted the featured image. Again, it depends on your template you're using, whether it will show it there or not. On my michaelgenati.com site, it does. Others, it doesn't. Um, but there's the video that I embedded. Now, if I go ahead and let's take this link here, I'm going to come out to my Facebook site and let's refresh here. 
I had started a demonstration of this earlier, which we don't want. There we go. So I'm going to go ahead and just paste that link right here. And look at what it does. It automatically then pulls that featured image and brings it in. And if I post it, it'll allow people to play. Uh, it'll click here. It'll bring them out to the post, and then they can play the video. So that's, in a nutshell, how we do that. Let's go ahead and delete all this. Let's go back to my home page. Yeah, leave the page. I don't want to put anything extra there. Um, oh, and look at that. I had done that earlier. I forgot to delete that. Delete. Delete. There we go. For demonstration purposes. So um, now that we're done, again, if you come back here to add that, it was really simple. We went to plugins. We selected add new. Typed in video thumbnails. Searched. We selected and clicked installed. Then when it installed, we selected activate and that's it. So I hope that helps you if you're using WordPress. I love WordPress. Use it all the time. If you do and you have questions, feel free to ask me here at michaelgenati.com. With that, this is Michael Genati bidding you have a great day. Take care and as always, ciao. I hope you liked the tutorial and if you have any problems, with this, you can contact me and my team below this video. So check the links below. See you soon.